evening, rock fans. It's Rick Cool with KMARS. And I'm Nigel Pumpernickel with KMARS as well. It's 72 degrees out, 420 in the morning, and let's get right to our show. The, the Top 20, 20 bizarre, bizarre, trippy, trippy quirky, quirky rock, rock vocal, vocal performances, performances that, that are just plain weird. weird. For the middle age. Let's kick it right off with number 20, Led Zeppelin's Dazed and Confused. <laughs> Wow, that's pretty trippy. And quirky. Maybe he could have thought of some words. Fum, fum, fum. Hmm. Okay, here's number 19. Molly Hatchet's Flirting with Disaster. <laughs> I'd say that's pretty bizarre and quirky. I guess the producer decided to leave it in. Here we go with number 18 of rock's most bizarre, trippy, quirky rock vocal performance that's just plain weird. Ozzy Osbourne's Crazy Train. <laughs> Wow. He must have been on a lot of drugs when he did that one, eh, Rick? Here's number 17, Blue Suede with Hooked on a Feeling. Oh, my God. Here's number 16 with The Pretenders. Middle of the road. Let's hear that one again. I mean, what is it? Is it a cat? Is it a harmonica? I don't know. In the middle of the road, yeah. All right. Here's number 15, Guns N' Roses with Welcome to the Jungle. Shana, nana, 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 knees, 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 wa, ah. Yeah, that's mm. pretty bizarre, wouldn't you say so, Nigel? I'd say it sucks, Rick. Here's number, number 14. Most bizarre, trippy, quirky rock vocal performance that's just plain weird. Hocus Pocus with Focus. <laughs> Nigel, I, I think that we should give them also number 14 for uh, later in the song. What do you think, Nigel? Oh, I, <laughs> I'd have to concur with you, Rick. It's, it's number 14 again. Hocus Pocus with Focus. <laughs> If that's not a bizarre, trippy, quirky rock vocal performance, I don't know what is. I don't know what type of glue they were sniffing on that one, but wow, let me have some of that. Here's number 13 with The Who, The Real Me. Can you see the real me, 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 Here's number 12 with David Lee Roth, just a chigolo. <laughs> what a tool, but it was quirky. Now here's number 11, musical youth, 
pass the Dochi. <laughs> I think we know what they were smoking on that one. Yeah, lots of weed. Speaking of weed, here's number 10, Black Sabbath, Sweet Leaf. <laughs> Right. What a great lyric. Is number nine, Aerosmith. Jill looks like a lady. Oh, oh, Here's number eight, the B-52s with Rock Lobster. <laughs> Who let Yoko Ono into the studio? <laughs> Whoa! It sounds like a seagull caught in a jet propeller. Now here's number seven, Minnie Ripperton, loving you. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> little birdies chirping there. All right, let's go on to number six Primus with Green Jello. All right, it's top five time. I'm excited, Nigel. Me too. Hey, uh, hey, Nigel. Yeah. Um, I got a little joke for you. All right. Uh, what does Robert Plant say when he gets his hand slammed in the car door? <laughs> Ridiculous, Rick. Well, here's number five, Elvis. <laughs> I wouldn't say that's bizarre or trippy. No, but it's quirky, all right. On to number four, Joe Cocker's Little Help From My Friends. <laughs> now that was cool. Now number three, Michael Jackson. Pretty much everything he ever did. <laughs> Shamon, Michael. <laughs> Shamon. You know, everything he did was really brilliant. <laughs> yes. And it it makes you wonder where Michael's bizarre, trippy quirkiness derived from. Well, that leads us right into number two, one of Michael Jackson's biggest influences. Mavis Staples, performing with Bob Dylan's band, The Band, in a song called the wait. She said, I gotta go, but my friend can stick around. Whoa, it's that mmm in Mavis Staples' voice that gets me all excited for what is gonna be the number one top 20 bizarre, bizarre trippy, trippy quirky, quirky rock, rock vocal, vocal performances, performances that, that are, are just plain weird. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah! Yay. Number one, the chairman of the board. Give me just a little more time. Just a little more time. And I'll sure Well, that's it for the show. Thanks for listening to KMARS.
I'm Rick Cool. And I'm Nigel Pumpernickel. See you next time. Bye.